Yesterday's rains moved out, making for a much sunnier and somewhat breezier Wednesday. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, it, it's those breezy winds. They've brought in all the change behind that mm -hmm. cold front. Now we're, of course, feeling a bit more appropriate for this time right. of year. It, it feels like fall. But it's not too cold out there yet. No, no, it's comfortable yeah. in the sun. It's just as soon as the sun goes down, I mean, those temperatures are going to be dropping well into the 40s tonight. You so. need more pumpkin spice lattes, and then you wouldn't be so cold. I'd rather have a pumpkin pie. Or that. <laughs> Well, here's your forecast. Whether you're eating pie or not, it is in the 60s. Sarah enjoys that forecast, right? Should we put pies in all the forecast? Sure. All right. Well, it's 63 in Lansing. We're talking about low to mid 60s across the board. It is still very comfortable, very pleasant. And look at this. Dew point plummeted. Low 40s, upper 30s for dew point. It is dry out there. And, of course, that encourages some clearing in the skies. We've had a few clouds here and there, but some sunshine as well. 60s to 50s across Michigan, 55 Marquette. Not any big cool downs or warm ups way out west. We're just going to be kind of maintaining a lot of our 60 degree range temperatures for the next few days. Some partial sunshine. Yeah, a few clouds around here and there. We do see some rain in the northern plains, but not a lot of rain in our own forecast that may work its way down here for Friday. Just a chance for rain here and there. For the most part, we're all going to be feeling the cool weather. We're talking highs in, in the 60s, lows in the 40s. That's at least for the first half of the seven day forecast. That includes a lot of the weekend. Chance for some weekend rain. Mainly we're talking a few showers Friday, maybe a few on Sunday, but storms next week will be a bit more high impact. That's still way down the line. For tonight, not a lot to show you, is there? Partly cloudy to mostly clear skies. Very pleasant evening, but it will be on the cool side, especially with those winds. They'll be weakening into the overnight Thursday. Tomorrow, partly sunny. Yeah, a few thin clouds, but the afternoon could be really quite bright and clear, especially given how dry it is. So there is going to be some sunshine to help us out in the temperatures. It'll feel cool. Cool, but in the heat of the afternoon, we're talking about a very pleasant end to your work day, but another cool night immediately follows. Friday's forecast, some partial cloud cover. Watch out for a few spotty rain showers in the daytime and maybe again at night, but it's not looking like much. Many of us may not see much of any rain on Friday and more so into, into the weekend too. Similar story. We'll see that in a minute, but mid 40s tonight. Mostly clear skies, very cool night ahead of us, really not too far below the average this time around. It is, this is getting to be very seasonable weather, mid and upper 60s, right where we should be. That's tomorrow's forecast, about 68 for an afternoon high, a cool morning, but a very pleasant afternoon, partly sunny skies. Those winds out of the southwest will help to push up our temperatures into those upper 60s. 70, I'm not so confident in 70, but upper 60s and then down to those low 60s on Friday, some cloud cover there and a chance for rain. The weekend ahead, cool Saturday, now looking to be nice and dry, partly sunny, but another chance for rain comes in on Sunday. Any weekend rainfall between Friday and Sunday is not looking like a lot, but early next week we will see a larger system come through with some thunderstorms. And notice those temperatures. Next week we do get a little bit warmer again. Low 70s to maybe even mid 70s by the middle of next week. And I'll say it again, and I'll say it again, and I'll say it again. We do get the warm weather here and there this time of year, but it just doesn't last. Yeah. So if you like those 70s, you know, I know it's getting to be the trees are changing colors. Mm -hmm. Maybe the gardens aren't going to need as much tending anymore, but. Those ACs are getting a break, that's for sure. They sure are. <laughs> I've been driving with a little bit of the windows down. It's nice. Yeah, certainly. It's Dustin. Thank you.